Welcome to today's edition of the AII, watching stock news, deal tracker, and advancements in artificial intelligence. This is a special edition of the AII featuring GBT Technologies, Inc. GBT Technologies is a development stage company developing IoT and artificial intelligence-enabled mobile technology. Formerly known as Gopher Protocol, Inc. and traded on the OTC under the ticker symbol GOPH, GBT Technologies is now traded on the OTC PINK under the symbol GOPHD. Hey folks, Sam Mowers here, back with another episode of the AII. For stock news today, GBT Technologies has successfully implemented its AI into a robot. Intel has launched its first AI chip, and H2O.AI has raised $72.5 million in a recent funding round led by the likes of Goldman Sachs and NVIDIA. Then we'll turn our attention to some projections in the global emotion analytics market. So GBT Technologies Inc., which is traded on the OTC pink under the ticker symbol GOPH, D has achieved a milestone with the successful implementation of its Avant AI technology into a robot to enable it to process information and reach conclusions on its own, thereby making it a self-learning system. Dr. Danny Rittman, GBT's CTO, explained, quote, We call this stage the self-learning stage. Here we successfully gave a complex machine the ability to learn without being explicitly programmed. The robot can be trained to perform tasks. It will learn from its performance in order to improve on it over time, exactly as a human would do. In addition, the robot will continuously improve its knowledge through online data research and other data resources for ways to improve task performance using GBT's knowledge extraction technology. End quote. Intel Corporation, which is traded on the NASDAQ under the ticker symbol INTC, has launched its first AI chip designed for large computing centers. The chip is called Nirvana NNP-T, or Spring Hill, and is based on a 10 nanometer Ice Lake processor that will allow it to cope with high workloads using minimal amounts of energy. Naveen Rao, the general manager of Intel's AI Products Group, explained, quote, In order to reach a future situation of AI everywhere, we have to deal with huge amounts of data generated and make sure organizations are equipped with what they need to make effective use of the data and process them where they are collected. These computers need acceleration for complex AI applications." End quote. And leading open source machine learning and AI platform H2O.AI has raised $72.5 million in a Series D funding round, bringing the total funding to $147 million. Leading the funding round were companies including Goldman Sachs, which is traded on the New York Stock Exchange under the ticker symbol GS, and NVIDIA Corporation, traded on the NASDAQ under the ticker symbol NVDA. Following this funding round, H2O.AI plans to, quote, accelerate innovation and expand sales and marketing globally with new investment to simplify AI for business users with new and groundbreaking technologies, end quote. Jeff Herbs, the Vice President of Business Development and Head of GPU Ventures at NVIDIA, commented, quote, NVIDIA has been working with H2O.AI for several years, and we're pleased to help accelerate their business with this further investment. H2O.AI is doing groundbreaking work in AI and machine learning, and their innovative GPU-accelerated driverless AI platform is gaining significant traction in markets around the world, end quote. That does it for stocks for the day. We'll turn to a report from Research and Markets, which finds that the global emotion analytics market is projected to grow to $5.1 billion U.S. by 2025, and that's with a compound annual growth rate of 15.6% in the forecast period 2019 to 2025. An excerpt from the report description outlines the market. Quote, Emotion analytics collects data about the verbal and nonverbal communication of a person to understand the person's mood or attitude. Technology also provides insights into how customers perceive a product, the presentation of a product, and the customer's interactions with customer service representatives. The global emotion analytics market is growing rapidly. Emotion analytics is widely used for various end users such as enterprises, defense and security agencies, commercial, industrial, among other, which are propelling the emotion analytics market growth. Companies are investing in AI and machine learning, which are boosting the growth of the emotion analytics market as well. For instance, the multimodal 
Emotion, artificial intelligence, is the combination of facial analytics and speech analytics that offer an insight into the human expression of emotion. And that's it for today's AII. If you would like to be a guest or sponsor for this podcast, contact InvestorIdeas.com. Investor Ideas reminds all listeners to read our disclaimers and disclosures on the InvestorIdeas.com website. And this podcast is not an endorsement to buy products or services or securities. Investors are reminded all investment involves risk and possible loss of investment. To hear more InvestorIdeas.com podcasts, please visit InvestorIdeas.com slash audio. And a reminder, you can also hear our podcasts on Spotify, iTunes, TuneIn, Stitcher, Spreaker.com, iHeartRadio.com, and Google Play Music. To learn more about GBT Technologies, Inc., please visit GopherProtocol.com or visit the InvestorIdeas.com profile page at InvestorIdeas.com slash CO slash GOPH. And for disclosure purposes, GBT Technologies is a PR news and social media featured company on InvestorIdeas.com.